Hi, I'm Leah from Jersey Drinks here with my friends at ShopRite, and we're here today to break down Bar Tools 101 and show you everything you need to stock your home bar. Not sure where to start? We're gonna break it down and talk about the quintessential cocktail shaker. I love having this on hand to mix up a variety of craft cocktails, shaken iced espressos, and making quick fresh lemonade at home. There's two types of cocktail shakers that you're gonna probably see. The first is gonna be a two-piece Boston shaker that comes together like this and the lock and seal. If you're new at shaking cocktails, I'm gonna definitely recommend you grab yourself a three-piece cobbler shaker. Super easy to navigate and comes with some extra built-in features to help you make foolproof cocktails. This cocktail shaker is three pieces, so you have your base where you're gonna be building all of your cocktails and a two-piece top that comes together with a built-in strainer to hold back ice, fresh herbs, and anything you might be muddling in a cocktail. Next up are gonna be our bar measuring tools, also called jiggers. These are key to making sure your cocktails are well-balanced, properly sweetened, and don't taste overly sour or bitter. There's three different types of uh, jiggers that exist. We're gonna have your standard size. This one is my personal favorite, the bell jigger that has this beautiful bell shape. And then of course, the more craft version of a Japanese uh, cocktail jigger. I'm gonna definitely recommend if you're starting out, you're just gonna wanna grab yourself that standard jigger. These come in not only in different shapes, but different sizes. They're gonna have measurements starting from a quarter ounce, half an ounce, three quarters of an ounce, up to one or two ounces. If you're just starting out, I would recommend you get one that ensures it calls out each of the measurements on the inside or the exterior of your jigger so that you can easily follow along and balance out those cocktails. And last but not least, my absolute two favorite bar tools that I think any home bartender or home chef will benefit from having in their cocktail bar repertoire. The first is a handheld citrus press. This is key to making fresh juices for your cocktails. Fresh is always best and my mantra for making delicious cocktails. You can also use this to squeeze fresh lemon, limes, and oranges into uh, salad dressings, vinaigrettes, or even to make juice shots right at home. And the second piece is our cocktail muddler. I absolutely love using this at home, not only for making mojitos and spicy margaritas, but also as a tool to mash up fresh avocados when you're making guacamole. And now that you have the tips and tricks to use not only multiple bar tools to make two different recipes, we're gonna show you how to use multiple ingredients to make two different recipes as well. We're gonna start by making our fresh spicy margarita. So I'm gonna use that jigger that we talked about earlier, and we're gonna measure half an ounce of agave syrup. You can get this at ShopRite in the baking and spices aisle right next to honey, all sorts of agave nectar you can find there. I'm using a light blue Weber agave syrup. We're just gonna add half of an ounce. Next, we're just gonna take some de-seeded jalapenos. I'm gonna cut about two, we'll go three rings. This is totally up to your preference on spice level. We're gonna just add that in. Anytime you're gonna take your muddler and muddle something in your cocktail, you're gonna wanna make sure whether it's herbs or veggies that there is a liquid component to really help you break up whatever it is you're muddling and get all those delicious flavors. Next, we're gonna take that citrus press that we were talking about earlier and grab two halves of a lime, so a whole lime for one ounce of fresh lime juice. You're gonna place that flat side down and just squeeze all of that delicious fresh juice right into your shaker. And just like I mentioned, we're gonna be using duplicate ingredients and duplicate tools. So let's add a little bit of this fresh lime juice before we put that citrus press away and squeeze a little bit of lime, fresh lime, right onto those delicious cut up avocados. that aside. And last, we're gonna be adding our tequila. So for this margarita, we're gonna be adding two ounces of Blanco unaged tequila right into our shaker. We're gonna add some ice to our glass first to get that chilling. And then we're gonna be adding two handfuls of ice right to our cocktail shaker. Pop that lid and we're gonna shake up our spicy margarita. Go ahead and pour this out. And 
And there we have a delicious spicy margarita that we're gonna sip while we finish up making our guacamole. Have a couple extra pieces of jalapeno, add that into our fresh avocado, lime juice, and you can use that muddler to muddle it and make fresh guacamole right alongside your delicious spicy margarita. And now that you're a pro on how to use all these bar tools right at home, be sure to follow our channel for more cocktail recipes. Cheers.